Good morning, everybody. Um, my name is Tony Payne, and uh, I'm the new director of the Centre for Christian Living. Uh, to, to save a lot of conversations at Morning Tea, that's a one-day-a-week position. I'm still working at Matthias Media. Um, but in the, in the approximately 37 minutes that I've officially been working for the Centre for Christian Living, <laughs> Uh, officially speaking, I've managed to get at least the college uh, mission statement down. Uh, as you know, the college exists to serve the Lord Jesus Christ by equipping men and women to know God better. And the centres that the college runs, like the Centre for Christian Living, really exist to explore and extend the implications and applications of that knowledge into every area of Christian life and ministry. And the Centre for Christian Living, as the name suggests, wants to explore what it means for the knowledge of God in Christ to extend into every aspect of our lives uh, every day as we live in the world. Uh, we do this really in order not only to serve you as the college students and graduates, but also the broader Christian community. Uh, and it's a very broad remit. The, the Centre for Christian Living aims to explore what it means to forgive one another in Christ, what it means to live as a Christian in the workplace, what it means to live in the family, in the church, uh, and in a broader society in, in which we live. Now, that's a very broad uh, remit, but the Christian life is like that. The Christian life covers everything, not just Sundays. And the role of the centre is to explore and extend and help the Christian community in Sydney to live out their lives as Christians. Now, in doing so, it's certainly not going to be just me who's doing the speaking and the extending and the talking. Um, my aim is to draw the faculty and the riches of, of biblical wisdom and scholarship that's here at Moore College out into the public sphere and get the faculty uh, extending and preaching and teaching and explaining what their work means for everyday Christian life for the people in your congregations and your fellowships around the Diocese of Sydney. Uh, during 2015 we'll be putting on five different events here at Moore College in this room and around the Diocese in a few different spots. Uh, the first of them will be on March the 11th and you've received a little card in your uh, great wad of paper on your seat uh, and you can see it's called Can We Talk About Islam? Uh, in the current rather fraught context we find ourselves in, uh, is it possible to talk about Islam as we bump into one another and talk about the subject every day over the water cooler, or as we talk with our Muslim friends, what do we say about Islam? Is it possible for us to have an open conversation as Christians in a way that honours God and tells the truth in love about the subject of Islam? And that's the first of our public events this year for the Centre for Christian Living. I hope that uh, you'll do three things in response to that. I hope that you'll come and join us for the launch night, launch night here on March the 11th. <clears throat> and in order to do so, excuse me, you'll need to register. It's a ticketed only affair this time on March the 11th. So go online on the uh, website that's mentioned here and sign up. <clears throat> excuse me. Secondly, please tell your congregation about this, about the work of the centre and about this opening launch night, which I'm sure will be of interest to them. It's a subject that touches all of us at the moment and which many of us feel very uncertain about. Uh, and thirdly, I hope that you'll pray for us, pray for the centre as I get moving and work out where to take it in this next year. And get in touch with me. Uh, you can email me at ccl at more.edu.au. Get in touch and tell me the kinds of things you'd like the centre to be addressing, the kind of issues that you know your people are grappling, grappling with in ethics and in Christian living, and we'll do our best to address them. I look forward to seeing you on March the 11th and throughout the year. Thanks.